Hello everyone and welcome! As a contribution to my procedural animation tutorial, I'm going to record the process of modeling and rigging of this quadrupod. In this video, you will learn how to correctly rig and export skeleton meshes into Unreal Engine. Then in the next video, you will learn how to use control rigs to solve for bone positions. If you plan to skip this video, go ahead, the files and projects are available in my Patreon for free. Now let's head straight into the modeling part where I start with a simple cylinder. For texturing, I decided to use vertex color, which is very simple to use and also fits my art style.
In order to put legs in a straight line, all I did was to rotate them 30 degrees, flatten them in Y direction, then rotate them back to fit into their positions. Bone transform space must be corrected before exporting to Unreal Engine. Access can be corrected by changing the roll property of each bone. In our case, the Y arrow is marking the forward direction, so we have to change the roll to place the Z arrow as up direction. We have to do this to all the bones to make sure the bone's spaces are consistent.
There are only few things that you should consider when exporting to Unreal Engine. First is the naming and the second is the scaling. You can see in the video how it did corrected the scaling of the bones. For exporting models into Unreal, I'm using Send2UE plugin from Epic Games. I put the link in the description so you can install it yourself. I hope you enjoyed this video, please don't forget to hit like and subscribe. See you in the next video, bye.